Now to the return to school, something on a lot of parents and teachers' minds. Due to the virus and quarantine guidelines, North Texas school districts are seeing a record number of teacher absences. And as I-Team reporter Brian New reports tonight, finding substitutes, that's never been more difficult. There is not a school day that goes by. I've done PE, I've done music, I do classroom. The DJ King in Arlington is not asked to substitute. I've had teacher, four or five teachers try to contact me for the same day. Same goes for Regina Lucero in Grapevine. Oh, it's incredible. I mean, I have to work every single day. The demand for substitute teachers across North Texas is high, and yet the number of those qualified and willing this year is at an all-time low. It's a classic supply and demand uh, question, right? The result is every day thousands of classrooms across North Texas go, not only without their regular teacher, but without a substitute teacher, forcing schools to pull in staff members, principals, even administrators into the classroom. And at times, that's not even enough, leaving schools with no other choice but to combine classes. Kudos to our, our schools for we're working through this and, and figuring it out, but at the same time, you know, as a district, we will do everything that we can to support them. Every school district in North Texas is struggling to find enough substitutes, but the CBS 11 I team found some districts are struggling far more than others. The I team looked at the area's 25 largest districts to find out how often schools were able to find a substitute when needed. Frisco ISD and Carrollton Farmers Branch ISD were able to find subs 87% of the time. That's nearly nine out of every 10 times a teacher was out. But then there are these six districts who struggled to find a sub nearly half the time. In Mesquite ISD, for every three teachers that were out during the fall semester, the district was only able to find one sub. In an effort to grow the pool of substitutes, Mesquite ISD has lowered the college hours subs are required to have to 30. The district is also handing out $500 bonuses to subs who work at least 50 days. A lot of districts have increased pay. Starting this month, Dallas ISD is increasing substitute pay by $20 a day. The district also recently hired an outside firm to help find additional subs. We're doing everything we absolutely can in um, getting substitutes into our schools and and helping our, our campuses and helping our teachers and principals. Subbing is a tough job, but those like DJ. I love it. And Regina say the job can be rewarding. I'm helping out by being in the classrooms and being with the kids. Especially in a year where their help is needed more than ever. Just knowing that you're helping make a difference, even though you're not a full-time staff, I guess it's a feeling of purpose that I'm actually, it may not be noticeable, but it's a small difference. On our website at cbsdfw.com, we have created an interactive map where you can look up your school district's substitute fill rate for the fall semester. We also have information and links for each district on how to apply to be a sub. In Mesquite, with the I-Team, Brian New, CBS 11 News. Brian, thank you, and a big tip of the cap to all of our educators.